Let's go up to the top left where it says content. Go to the blue button where it says add content. On the next page, choose landing page. We are going to add a landing page into this title field up here. And from this drop down, we will select two columns as our layout. Let's click Save. Just like that, we have added a new piece of content to our website. But you will notice that there's not a lot here. And that's because a landing page needs to add sections to it. So let's click on the Edit tab. On the left side of this administration interface, you will have areas to add different sections or paragraphs of content to a landing page. Now, if you click on this content area and you see this Add One Column button here, we will click on the down arrow right here. Scroll down from the options and click on Add Simple Content. The simple content paragraph type gives you a place where I can enter text. And I can also add another line. And I can style a heading. Go right here to this little A button and click on purple. Let's make this bold, italic, underlined. We'll set this as 16, and we'll give it a heading styling. Let's go down to the bottom here in this blue button and click Save again. And just like that, we have added styling onto our landing page. The simple content paragraph type just adds some simple content. It adds some text that you can style. If I go in and click on Edit, I go back to that content area again and click on the Edit tab for simple content. You will notice that there are a ton of options here to style your text. And wherever you see this text editor, you can add similar text. It will style exactly the same. Go down right here where it says Add One Column, click on the arrow, and search for where it says Add FAQ. This section is slightly different than the simple content, but you'll notice it has that same text editor field right here. So if I copy what's in the text editor field up here, paste it down here, and I add a question into my question field, click Save, and just like that, I've added a new section of content, but rather than adding this simple styling, it embeds it inside what's called an accordion tab. So my question is pre-styled for me, and it opens up, and the text inside of a question is styled exactly like what's up here. Let's click on the Edit tab one more time and open our content area. You can add as many different sections or paragraphs as you want to the content area. You can also use this little arrow down here to rearrange your content by dragging it up or down. You can edit the content at any time. If you click on the down arrow, you can see the option to remove it. And it will ask you to confirm your removal if you decide that you want to delete something. And if you change your mind, you can click on the Restore tab. When a section opens up, you can edit it. And then when you're done editing, you can collapse it and add more sections of content below.